Hi, my name is Andrew Fairley. Uh, today I'm going to cook a warm salad of Albert Bartlett Jersey Royals with some fresh herbs. So the important thing about this salad is that we want to add the dressing to the potatoes while the potatoes are still warm. That way they soak up the dressing and you get the seasoning right the way through the potatoes. So I'm just going to wash these in cold running water now and get them on to cook. Okay, so while the potatoes are on to cook, I'm going to get my dressing on. So first thing I'm going to do is take a spoonful of Dijon mustard. To that I'm going to add some Chardonnay vinegar, a couple of tablespoonfuls. And then I'm going to whisk that together. So basically what I've done here, I've got the bowl in a pot with a wet towel just to keep the bowl still so it doesn't slip all over the board. So at this point I'm going to add a good pinch of fresh sea salt. Again, whisk that into the vinegar and mustard. And then I'm going to start adding my peanut oil. I'm going to add this slowly at the beginning. So the mustard in this vinaigrette actually emulsifies the vinaigrette so it coats the potatoes. What we don't want is a vinaigrette that splits, so you've got the vinegar on the bottom, then the oil floating on the top. It just gives a kind of greasy mouthfeel to the to the finished salad. So I think that I can just show you that at the moment. So you can see the vinaigrette has quite a thick texture to it. So if we're to leave that overnight, it would separate, but for intentions of the salad that we're doing, that's a perfect consistency. Okay, so that's the peanut oil. Now what I'm going to do is add some rapeseed oil to this as well. I think the peanut oil for me is just a little bit bland on its own, but the rapeseed oil is a little bit too strong on its own, so I just kind of want to balance both the flavours here. And what can sometimes happen when you're making this dressing is it can actually get too thick. So if it does, we're just going to add a spoonful of warm water just to get it to the consistency that we want. So if I can just let you see that. You see the consistency of the vinaigrette? It's almost like a mayonnaise. I'm just going to add a spoonful of warm water. Okay, so that's our dressing ready. So we're just going to leave that there while we get the potatoes. Okay, so here are the drained potatoes, just warm enough to handle. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to cut them in half. This way it allows the vinaigrette to just seep through the potatoes. Okay, so say that's the potatoes cut in half, they're still warm. So what I'm going to do now is just pour that dressing over the warm potatoes. A little bit of freshly ground pepper and to that I'm just going to add plenty freshly chopped herbs, so say it's chives, some flat parsley and some dill. So I'm gently going to turn the potatoes with the dressing. So this salad can be eaten warm as it is, or it can be left to go cold. But I would eat it at room temperature. I wouldn't really put it in the fridge. I think it dulls the flavour of the potato. So there we go. Just going to put it into serving bowl. I'm going to sprinkle a few freshly chopped herbs on the top. And then just to finish it off, last thing, just a few sliced spring onions. And there we have an Albert Bartlett Jersey Royal Potatoes with fresh herbs.